guys, it's me, Anna Anders, humbly here at 4GlobalPeace.com, standing on a sidewalk here in local Flagstaff, Arizona, and I'm standing across the street from um, the mission, the homeless mission, where they help people that are homeless, and mainly, I believe this is the men's mission, um, but what I wanted to, to point out here today is to point out the American flag on the flagpole. But right directly underneath it is the Israeli flag. Um, and I don't know if it's going to blow out or not with the wind, but we'll see. There you go. You can see it. Well, thank you, Creator, for showing that. Um, showing the flags that are hanging, actually. Um, I needed the wind to blow that up, and so it's happening. <laughs> there we go. It's even better. Um, so there you go. And what I want to know today, what I want to put a challenge to uh, the mission here, the homeless shelters in Flagstaff, Arizona, here this uh, February 2015 day, uh, Saturday. Um, I believe it's the 7th, but I'm not sure. Um, but I'll check the date later. But more importantly, the reason I'm drawing this uh, attention is I want to know what does the mission have to do with this uh, Israeli flag being hung underneath the American flag. Um, I think it kind of suggests publicly um, that we are supporting Israel only. And honestly, this is the United States of America where, um, how do I say this? where all cultures come together to live in this great country. So why should we single out one country to be, um, how do I say this, to be supportive of them only? You know what I'm saying? To me, it's kind of, something is funny here. And so this is why I'm doing the YouTube video today here in Flagstaff, Arizona, humbly. This video is two minutes long and I'm gonna do another video because when I actually got to Flagstaff, initially in May of 97, I stayed at the uh, Weatherford Hotel. It was actually a hostel at the time, and I was staying there, and I came on a humble pay, uh, well, on a humble stipend, if you will, when I came out here initially. But um, what happened was somebody suggested that I go over to the woman's mission from that hostel, so I did. And one thing after another evolved. My journey here evolved, but then also, um, how do I say this? Um, Oh, I know how to say it. Within a week's time, I had a job and a home, and I was working for Flagstaff Medical uh, Physicians, um, working in the health insurance industry. So, but I just want to point this out today, and I'm going to do a second YouTube video. And interestingly enough, I was invited out today to an auction, and to tell you the truth, um, the lady that founded or that works for the mission here in town still today. And she was there when I first came to Flagstaff in May of 97. Um, I saw her today at the auction and I asked her, why is the Israeli flag hanging? And she point blank told me, because we support Israel. And I was like, that's really corrupt that you're just singling out one country and supporting one country. Something is very fishy about all this and I'm telling you, and I already know why and how and what for. So I'm humbly Anna Anders. This video is way too long. I'm going to turn it off and then I'm going to upload another video uh, from the Woman's Hope Cottage here locally in Flagstaff, Arizona. Thank you. Which is where I stayed when I first came to Flagstaff, May of 97. Thank you so much for tuning in and subscribing to my YouTube videos. Have a wonderful day, everybody. Peace out.